Hi, I'm Sean Ginn, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about properties of logarithms. I'm going to condense each expression to a single logarithm. So, if I was giving this logarithm, 6 log the third of the base of u, log base 3 of u, plus 6 log base 3 of v. Okay. Well, if we want to condense this, the first thing I'm thinking about here is I see what's in front of each log. There's a number. I'm going to put that as the power of the u and v, excuse me, respectively. So we have a log base 3 of u to the 6th power now plus log base 3 of v to the 6th power. So now from here, we can condense this to one big logarithm, right? They both have a base of 3. So when doing so, that addition becomes multiplication. So we have the log now, log of 3, put parentheses now, of u to the 6 times v to the 6. All right? And that parentheses just show that it would take a log base 3 of that whole thing. But that multiplication came from the addition. So again, this is our final answer here of log base 3 of parentheses u to the 6 times v to the 6. Let's recap. We're given 6 log base 3 of u plus 6 log base 3 of v. And we want to condense this. Well, first step is both of them have a number 6 right out front. I wrote that as the exponent to each one of these powers. Okay, I'll put the exponent of each power. The exponent of the u and the v, each one of these variables. Then from there, we want, we want to condense to be one big logarithm. They both have log base 3, so we can condense it. That addition becomes multiplication of just the variables here. And so again, our final answer here is just log base 3 of parentheses u to the 6 times v to the 6. 